happening now. A deadly deputy involved shooting under investigation in southwest Harris County. Officials say a deputy in plain clothes shot and killed a man who approached him with a gun. This all happened on East Ritter Circle and McLean around 6 o'clock this morning. Channel 2's Vincent Crivelli is joining us live with the details on this one. Vince? Christine, good morning. This is still a very active scene. Let me show you guys what's going on. Several different agencies are here investigating. Right now, the working theory is a neighbor was house watching for another neighbor, came outside, and for some reason pulled what appeared to be a pistol on a deputy in street clothes. Then that deputy opened fire. This perplexing situation began when a number of Gulf Coast Task Force officers were in this neighborhood looking to capture a capital murder suspect from Mesquite. One of the neighbors on this street came out to find out what was going on. Authorities say that neighbor approached a deputy in street clothes in an unmarked car, knocked on the window, and showed a flashlight and pistol. The deputy put down his, his window, drew his pistol. Some words were exchanged. Then deputies say the neighbor lowered the flashlight and raised his pistol. At that time, the deputy fired two rounds, striking the male once. Investigators say the neighbor ran down the street and died in his car. Now detectives believe the pistol the man had was in fact a BB gun. We suspect that it is not a real firearm, but it looks just like a, a black Glock 17. And neighbors tell me the man that was killed was shot outside the home he was watching for another neighbor that's in the hospital. He was watching a house on this street, but he didn't live at that house. Another neighbor says that home may have been broken into recently, so the deceased was on high alert. And members of the DA's office are on scene. A critical piece of information they're trying to find out right now. What words were exchanged before the deputy opened fire? Still a lot to sort out here. For now, reporting live in Missouri City, Vincent Crivelli, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Vince.